Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 12th or thereabouts. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid because there are no times really in the universe. Really, there is not divine timing. Um, this reading is not sign specific. And I picked out these flowers actually for my Leo three month uh, forecast. And when I picked them up and I smelled them, I thought, geez, it smells like a freaking funeral. It smells like a funeral. It smells like a funeral. So I don't know. I mean, I don't know what's going on here. I see the Four of Cups. The Four of Cups, there's discontent. Somebody is doing a lot of thinking, thinking about a, a lost opportunity, brooding. Um, they may have some sort of regrets. I feel as though somebody is very, very overwhelmed. It's, it's, it's just too much. This is, this is too much. It's too much. It's overwhelming. Um, we have a, we have a major completion here. And I say that because I just saw the world. Okay. The world, the world is a major completion. It's the end. It's the end of a phase. Um, somebody has, uh, completed a life lesson and now there's going to be a new beginning. Somebody may be traveling. They may be moving. It's like, it's good. It's like a whole nother world is about to open up. Okay. But there has been some sort of, of sadness over how the last lesson ended, how it ended. You may not think it was a success, but it was because whenever you learn a lesson, you don't learn from easy lessons. Nobody learns from an easy lesson. Not really. It doesn't stick. You don't remember it. You learn from the hard lessons. So somebody has learned a hard lesson. So you should consider that a success. Now I see the nine of cups, which is, which is going through a recovery, having, having uh, satisfaction harmony and peace and happiness. Now there's an opportunity for happiness after that hard, difficult list lesson was learned. You had to learn that lesson to get to where you are now. Now I see the chariot. So the chariot is moving forward very, 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 very quickly, mastering your emotions, getting in the driver's seat and taking off. Somebody's actually moving and they're like packing their car up or they're packing up themselves or whatever. Somebody is absolutely moving. This is a the chariot is a card of transformation. So there is a sort of some sort of uh, inner transformation that is about to begin or it has begun. Heading to towards a new destination. There's been a lot of life challenges. I just saw the nine of wands. That's life challenges. And somebody ha is needing to find that strength with the chariot and the nine of wands to keep going. Yes, that was difficult. But you, it's over now and it's time to begin again. So we do have a new beginning here. Ace of Pentacles. This is a this is a big new beginning. This is this is potential the potential for abundance. Ace of Pentacles. This is prosperity. This is a gift. 
This is a golden opportunity. Somebody is about to see it too. This is so big you aren't going to, you. there's no way you can miss it, okay? It's like you traveled down that path and it's so big. It's big. This is a big opportunity that is, it's been above you, but I think it's about to be shown to you. Somebody has manifested something. They've manifested something and there's something coming. Hmm. Oh my God. The world. This is your new beginning right here. We have a, we have a major new beginning here. That is what we have. I mean, this is really big. This is a completion of all completions. Look at that. A card didn't pick up. We're going to have to take it. It is the completion of all completions. It's something big. It's not something little. This is something that has been very um, predominant in your life for a long time. It's affected you for a long time. It's over. It's done. And now you got a bigger, better opportunity right in front of you. Oh, the chariot. It's reversed. It's funny that I saw that. Um, the chariot is somebody that has been stuck. You see, this is, this is the past and this is the future. And this is what you get. Okay, somebody has been stuck. There's a lack of willpower to move on. There was a loss of direction, a lack of discipline. We had somebody here that could not find their mental strength. Somebody that was being held back, you know, and letting themselves be controlled by a situation. Uh -huh. But now we have a golden opportunity being presented. Major new beginning here. Universally driven. Somebody was resisting the change. They were. Not seeing because this was so far. They couldn't see that they had a bigger, better opportunity. They couldn't see it. This opportunity comes at the point that you complete that last lesson. Now that somebody has completed that hard lesson, here comes your reward. This is a reward. Somebody was blocking their reward by not making the move, by not mastering their emotions, by staying in a situation that was going nowhere. But we have a reward coming. We do. Ooh, the hair of font reversed. This is lack of faith. Nine of Wands. Nine of Wands reversed. We have somebody here that doesn't, you know, has great personal fear and does not trust, does not have any faith. It's like lost faith in humanity. Oh, somebody has lost faith. You have to believe, okay? Don't make sure this is you need to believe. You need to believe. Believe that everything happens for a reason. I feel I mean this nine of wands reverse, this is somebody that has been wounded very, very badly and has great personal fear. Uh, is has hard feelings over that this lesson that was learned. So we do have somebody here that is um angry and not no faith no faith in in god no faith in in new beginnings no faith in <sighs> getting back out there we do have somebody here that is struggling going through their own little mental power struggle here Hmm. 
there's some sort of tension. With the five of wands, there's definitely fear. Fear of getting in another commitment, fear of getting attached, fear of believing, fear of uh, getting played again. Six of Wands, but this is being recognized and respected. Somebody is recognized and respected for uh, finding their ability to move forward, to follow through. This is a card to succeed. To have victory. People are recognizing a person's nobility. They're recognizing a person's strength. The person that learned the lesson may not realize, you know, may not realize that they are recognized for, the, for their success. You may not believe it. You may not have faith. You may feel like the world is out to get you, but the world is not out to get you. This was a lesson that needed to be learned so that you could be strong. <laughs> Somebody is, is making progress. They are going to make progress. They are heading in the right direction, absolutely. And they're heading away from conflict. You may have to move forward with blind faith and let go of those hard feelings. Be confident. Be confident in yourself. The hermit. Go within. Reflect. Take a time out. Plan B. Come up with a new plan. And that's what's going on here. Somebody is, is coming up with a new plan. Becoming self-aware through, uh, through stillness, through uh, being alone. Now this is all, look at that light. That's a big, big, big light. This is illuminating. Something is going to be illuminated. This is an illuminating light. I feel like you're, somebody is going to see something. Somebody is going to see something. King of Pentacles, reverse. Could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Virgo here. We have Cancer here. We have Taurus here. Definitely we have earth energy here. So this is this is like walking away. Somebody is has been reluctant to walk away from something, but it's like now they see the light. Now they see the light. It's time to let this go. It's not practical, it's not it's not reasonable, it's not stable, it's not solid. We have somebody here that is very stubborn. This person um, may have not been loyal. King of Coins reversed. This person uh, doesn't have money, makes poor financial decisions. I think this person has regrets. Perhaps somebody has walked away from them because of their irresponsibility. We have somebody here that's irresponsible, made some poor choices. and But now, now they see, now they see 
that but it's like it's too late yeah it's like they acted foolishly somebody acted foolishly they acted recklessly which caused somebody to walk away it caused somebody to leave somebody put the brakes on because somebody you know this person may have cheated they may have spent money uh, they acted foolishly they acted they they weren't uh, very wise put it that way they may have had a drinking problem But now with the hermit, this is through stillness, somebody has realized their foolishness. They have. And they have learned a lesson, and it was a hard one. And that is Saturn's finger. And I didn't even realize it till just now. I, did, I noticed it in my other video. Look it up. We are in Saturn energy. So, it, And I didn't even mean it, but whatever. Um, it's funny, I hadn't done that in a while, but I noticed it in one of my videos and I just noticed it again. Interesting. Um, king of Cups. So we have this King of Cups. This is a very feeling king. Heartfelt. But doesn't somebody doesn't want a commitment. What the hell is this? Ooh, Nine of Cups reversed, dissatisfied. I don't know if this is the same scenario or not, but we have somebody here that is a very, you know, feeling individual. This person is emotional. This person um, has a big heart, but is very dissatisfied with something. Oh, the Empress reversed, dissatisfied that he lost something okay maybe he I mean this is wounded and this could be a wife it could be a girlfriend it could be a mother um, dissatisfied and unhappy he's 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 unhappy that he did not see her value he didn't see her worth He's unhappy that he caused her pain. Now, this person right here may have engaged themselves in, in this in a poor way. This person didn't trust. This person had great personal fear. This person was petty. This person was jealous. This person was suspicious. This person um, may have engaged with other people, flirted with other people, or talked to other people, and, you know, egged it on. This person didn't know their value, didn't know their worth. Obviously, she's in reverse. This is somebody that um, was jealous and lazy and bitchy and um, probably thought she was it when she wasn't. You know. Ooh, the tower reverse. So this is, uh, avoiding, avoiding disaster. Somebody was trying to avoid disruption. And I feel like they tried to avoid disruption by taking the easy way out, you know? They didn't build a solid foundation. And I think we have somebody here that is unhappy and dissatisfied with their foolishness. It's like now there's there's an uproar. Somebody has moved on or they're moving on. Uh, 
there's going to be a conflict with a woman. This is a woman, okay? And I don't care what anybody says. I really don't. I don't. This is a fucking woman, okay? So there is a conflict with a woman that really is unavoidable. It's unavoidable. It is. You might try it. You can try to avoid it until you are blue in the face. It is unavo it's unavoidable. This person isn't going to be happy. This person is not happy. There's going to be a conflict. The magician reversed. Whew, there's been some manipulation. There's been some lies. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth. There's been some deception. Somebody's been dealing with a very a sneaky, shady individual who manipulated them and got them engaged in a false sense of security. Probably just to prove a point to another woman. Somebody's false foundation is going to crumble. And tell me, it, it really is. You can only avoid it for so long, or it already has crumbled. This is a major completion that has happened or is about to happen. Somebody hurt another person. This is wounded. There's definitely some hard feelings here. There is hard feelings over all the conflict that has been caused and all the people that got involved in this situation. So many people got involved when they should have just kept their nose out of it. But this is making progress, moving forward towards victory and harmony. But we have this magician reverse, so somebody has been duped. They've been lied to. And karma, karma, karma. So, yes. Okay, somebody hasn't been telling the truth. And if they haven't learned their lesson, they're about to. And, you know, this. if you were to watch the astrologers, this is a, you know, next couple of weeks or whatever. A uh, couple of months is about karma. And it's bad karma. Somebody engaged uh, themselves in a situation that they shouldn't have. And karma has come in or is coming to kick somebody in the ass. Just saying. Um, it may be, it may be uh, a feeling of disbelief. Okay? Because the hair font is reversed. You may, it may be unbelievable to you. It may be unbelievable this, that this is happening. Um, but this is a completion of all completion. Somebody is about to get enlightened. If they haven't been enlightened, they are about to. Something is about to be brought to the light because I see something being shown with this card in this in this deck. So, somebody's foolishness is about to be shown. I think what we have here is I think that we have somebody here that engaged with somebody that they shouldn't have. They were foolish, very foolish. Now we have this person who is looking at and very dissatisfied with the deception, very dissatisfied and unhappy with um, what is being said about them, the conflict that has it has caused. There, this person. Um, It's like the trick's on you, the joke's on you now, you know, that's what it looks like to me. Page of Swords, this person is absolutely watching, very much so, watching, observing. Um, this is, this is the Eight of Swords reverse, this is lies. There's some sort of obstacle that is being removed, cutting themselves free. From somebody, somebody that they have been stuck with, 
Some, this is the sword that's going to cut this person free. Somebody is about to be cut free from... Somebody. A difficult situation. The six of six of uh, cups reverse. This is this person is reminiscing about the past, constantly thinking about the past, thinking about what they did. Oh my God! Nonstop, nonstop. They are. Thinking about the past, what happened in the past, how they treated this other person they are. But this person doesn't want a commitment, doesn't want marriage. Very immature. They may present themselves as a king and acts like a boy. Could be a, a, a boy in a man's body, you know. This is being cut loose by this woman. Ha! Both of these people are reminiscing heavily. Heavily, heavily, heavily. Just saying, both people are reminiscing heavily. But the magician reverse, that is, that is very cunning, very deceptive, very crafty. But we have somebody that is moving on from a crafty, deceptive individual. They got they they're taking the bigger better opportunity. This is the last card. There it is right there. Lesson learned. I'm taking the bigger better opportunity. Thank you very much. Somebody has manifested something new. Through their pain and suffering, they have manifested something new. So we do have a new door opening up. Absolutely. We have a major new beginning here. Something is about to be shown to you. It is big. It is huge. For you persevering through this difficult situation where you were deceived and lied to and played. Somebody is going to recognize your value. They're going to recognize your nobility. They're going to see, they see, or they've been watching. Somebody's been watching you and they see that you have been burned. They see that you have been wounded. They see that you were undervalued and they see that somebody fucked up. And now we got somebody coming in with an opportunity for you. Somebody is coming in with an opportunity. You manifested it. You asked for it. This is your reward. There it is. This is your reward. This is the wheel of fortune. This is your reward. You passed. Hopefully it's this reading is for you. This is good luck. This is a major turning point. That last chapter, that last cycle is over. Somebody's course is changing. This is lucky. This is this is good luck. This is good fortune. This was meant to happen. Here you go. So somebody has somebody that is, is going to communicate with them that has been watching them. They've seen the whole situation go down. And you got somebody coming with something solid. It's a big, bright opportunity. It is. That's what it is. I mean, there's nothing else for me to say. This is a new enterprise, a new doorway, a new path opening up. This is a new offer. This is, this is exciting. It really is. And I feel like this it starts out right here. Somebody, they take it. It's like I'm taking the bigger, better opportunity. Lesson learned. I'm not going back. I'm not going back to the irresponsible, unloyal, foolish individual who used me. End of story. We have a new beginning here. I I, the damn camera died.
anyway, I was saying that this is your opportunity, this is your reward for completing that cycle, for stepping over the finish line. That lesson is over. It's time to begin on your next one. Somebody that has been watching you, I think somebody that has been watching you is about to come out of hiding. They're about to come out of hiding. I think this is somebody that you have known. This is somebody that you know. You know right now. You know this person right now. This person's been watching you for sure. Absolutely. Anyway, good luck. It's almost like they're coming to escort you. That's what I heard. They're coming to escort you. Whatever that means, I don't know. Okay, go. Bye.